Hey everyone, Grace here, and I'm just going to be doing a quick little video on freezing multiple panes. So, first, where do I go to freeze panes? Well, that's going to be under the View tab. So if you click View, mine automatically show up here, but it's going to be in this general area towards the um, right-hand side of the View tab up above. And... I have this option to freeze panes, freeze top row, and freeze first column. Now if a task asks you to freeze the top row or freeze the first column, we know pretty easily you're just going to click on one of these, maybe both, and then it's got these frozen for you. We're going to unfreeze them. Let's say for some reason it wanted us to freeze the top two rows and the top two columns. What we're going to do is you're going to find the cell diagonally adjacent to where that would be. So let's think about it. We want to freeze cells A and B, so we're going to be clicking a cell somewhere in the C. Then we want to freeze the rows 1 and 2, so that means we're going to click on C3 because it's right next to these two columns and these two rows. And then what I'm going to do is just have the cell clicked and then click freeze panes. And if you notice, the nice little line pops up and it's freezing the first two columns in the first two rows. So then if I swipe, you see those two things. Now let's do one more example. I'm just gonna unfreeze those. Let's say I wanted to have the first four rows frozen. So if I just go down to one, two, three, four, click on the fifth row, click freeze panes, and it's got the first four rows done. That's all. Thanks.